Understanding how narcissists monitor you online after no contact. Everyone, today we're talking about something that many people can relate to, how to deal with narcissists trying to reconnect after you've cut ties with them. It's important to focus on taking care of yourself when faced with this situation. Throughout this discussion, we'll highlight signs that suggest a narcissist is trying to invade your boundaries again. Understanding these signs can help you protect the space you've worked hard to create for yourself. Dealing with narcissistic individuals is tough. They can be relentless and use manipulative tactics. That's why it's crucial to stay alert and prioritize your mental and emotional well-being. We'll share practical tips to help you handle these encounters with grace and resilience. Whether you're currently dealing with this or want to prepare for the future, our goal is to give you the tools to maintain a healthy distance from toxic people. Now let's talk about dealing with narcissists after cutting contact and come out of it stronger and wiser. 1. Digital Surveillance Tactics In today's world, social media plays a big role in relationships. Narcissistic individuals often use it to try to control others by monitoring their online activities closely. Being aware of this and taking steps to protect your privacy online is important. 2. Concealed communications from mysterious origins. Receiving messages from unknown sources can spark curiosity or discomfort, especially when they arrive from unfamiliar numbers or accounts. Narcissists often employ this tactic to catch people off guard, using surprise to manipulate. The sudden influx of messages from strangers can unsettle recipients potentially leading to emotional manipulation or deceit. It's crucial for individuals to stay vigilant and develop strategies to handle such anonymous communications effectively. 3. Exploiting emotions during crisis. Dealing with emotional exploitation often involves confronting individuals with narcissistic traits who exploit significant events to manipulate emotions and gain sympathy. Their goal is to break down emotional defenses and gain control over reactions. To defend against such manipulation, it's important to stay informed about current events from reliable sources and carefully evaluate information before reacting emotionally. Developing critical thinking skills enables individuals to question the authenticity of news and determine whether it serves a genuine purpose or is crafted for manipulative purposes. 4. Strategic Communication Link In the realm of manipulative communication, Lengthy messages serve as a powerful tool. These verbose emails or letters, seemingly harmless at first, are crafted to evoke specific reactions. Lengthy communication is used to capture attention, manipulate emotions, and assert dominance. Understanding the motives behind these verbose messages is crucial for breaking free from their influence. A strategy to counter their impact involves resisting the urge to engage directly. Instead of providing the expected response, individuals can choose to disengage and set boundaries. This change in approach denies the manipulator the satisfaction of a response and disrupts their intended power dynamics. 5. Surprise encounters with narcissists. Running into a narcissist in places you frequent may seem coincidental, but it's often a deliberate tactic. They position themselves strategically to disrupt your peace and maintain control. To effectively maintain a no-contact strategy, it's crucial to stay alert and use avoidance tactics without getting drawn into confrontation. By recognizing their tactics and refusing to engage in the manipulative games, you can stick to your no-contact approach and prioritize your mental well-being. 6. Manipulative Allies The Flying Monkey Strategy When dealing with narcissists, watch out for the flying monkey strategy where they use third parties to gather information or pressure you into breaking no contact. These could be friends, family, or acquaintances acting on behalf of the narcissist. It's essential to identify these tactics and strengthen your defenses against potential intrusions. By staying vigilant and recognizing when someone is being manipulated, you can protect your emotional health and maintain the boundaries you've set. In conclusion, Remember that a narcissist's return isn't a sign of genuine care, but a calculated move for manipulation. Whether they're being charming or provocative, their aim is always to dominate and maintain their control. 
protecting yourself means sticking to the no-contact strategy. By cutting off communication and reinforcing your emotional boundaries, you deny the narcissist the reactions they crave. Seek support from trusted friends and family who understand and uplift you. Silence can be a powerful tool in thwarting the narcissist's tactics.